Buonasera, benvenuti agli eventi della comunità. Di recente il nostro direttore Ali Bidabadi era presente alla mostra d'arte presentata da Friends in Art intitolata The Heart of the Matter. Con i lavori di 20 artisti presentati alla Galleria d'Arte JD Carrier Art Gallery. In supporto di artisti canadesi, Villa Cernis e Hospice One. Vediamo insieme il servizio del nostro direttore. Paris Mauro e stasera siamo al Columbus Center, al Joseph T. Carrier Gallery per una dimostrazione di arte, una esposizione di arte che si chiama The Heart of the Matter. È stata fondata un'organizzazione Friends in Art che ha deciso di fare un'esposizione di arte che appartiene, che tutta appartiene al cuore, le emozioni belle e le, anche quelle brutte. E siamo qui al Columbus Center per vedere tutte queste bellissime opere di arte. We love to laugh, we love to eat, and we love art. So we decided to form a company, a partnership called Friends in Art. So we decided to last summer we started talking about it and we started planning it so it's important because we we want to get art and community to come together and to do it with people that you really love and get along with it's a it's a passion project uh we're going to go through the social media um channels the three of us are very well connected we're just gonna you know get our brand out there start talking about it And uh, so far, people are very impressed with tonight. So I'm sure word of mouth will get around. artistici sono fatti, sono disegnati dagli artisti locali. Sono 20 artisti e abbiamo, uh, abbiamo 60 diversi pezzi e sono uno più bello dell'altro e, e quindi è molto meraviglioso perché tutti i pezzi appartengono all'artista molto personalmente che, e, e parla alle emozioni del cuore. So the Heart of the Matter collection has um, a number of artists and they are all from various cultural backgrounds as well as different stages in their life. So for example, we have an artist who's 89 years old and um, she paints some of the most vibrant works within the collection. So it's really beautiful because Here are artists coming from various diasporas, various parts of the city, various backgrounds, various experiences, and they're all united with this one common theme, and that is to share, you know, what they have in their hearts. I think it's beautiful. My name is Michael Tanalia and uh, the two pieces back there are mine. I am uh, I'm a photographer and a painter. It started a long time ago in elementary school. I was encouraged uh, with my drawing and painting and then I went to, I went to an, a specialty art high school. I continued with painting and then as a career I became a photographer. So my painting evolved into photography. So instead of painting with paint, I paint with light right now. And the most important thing about this show is that it brings the community together and it's, it's the way we express ourselves. So this piece, these pieces are an expression of an event that happened to me in my life. And to get it out as a photo, it's very important and to bring people together. Hi, 
my name is Luisa Cisneros. I'm non-binary Mexican Canadian Mexican artist, and um, I think it is, first of all, it is important for us to have a spaces like these, thanks to Aurora, the curator, and the, the entire community that are, they create these spaces where we can share our pieces of art. Um, I migrated in 2005 from Mexico and I have had different opportunities and tried to show my artwork. I also went to OCAP, so I just study like art in there and this is really important for us to evolve as an artist, especially having a spaces like these that we have the opportunity to showcase pieces. So in this case, my piece talks about immigration and the different layers as we have as artists to create our personas related to land and our experience as immigrants here in this beautiful country of Canada. artists uh, we are preoccupied with oh what will people think will they connect to the work I think that this exhibit proves that as long as you're painting or creating from the heart everyone is going to connect because it is the thing that unites us all as humans so I would encourage everyone to come out and that includes from young and old families because there is something for everyone here quindi noi, Friends in Art, gli amici in arte, abbiamo voluto fare un'esposizione del genere proprio per la comunità, per coinvolgere la comunità e specialmente gli artisti che vogliono esporre le loro, le loro opere d'arte, che magari non hanno un mezzo di poter farlo vedere, di poter esprimerli. Quindi è molto importante dare l'appoggio all'arte, continuare a mostrare eh, le opere di arte e questa è un'opportunità per fare proprio ciò. mostra che come abbiamo visto tante cose che abbiamo nel cuore grazie agli artisti che hanno partecipato un evento molto bello che ancora una volta ci ha dato la possibilità di conoscere meglio gli artisti con dei lavori molto belli e vedere un evento della nostra comunità in questo caso presentato da Friends in Arts o Amici d'arte